Everything happens for a reason Everything, everything Everything happens for a reason Everything, everything Everything, everything Everything for a reason Everything, everything Everything for a reason Everything happens for a reason Everything happens for a reason So you want to use the internet? Be nice You gotta be kind to people online A good friend you might find you gotta be kind to people online don't be a don't be a don't be a cyber bully you gotta be kind to people online a good friend is what you might find you gotta be kind to people online don't be a don't be a don't be a cyber bully it's never okay to post rumors and threats to spread lies about your peers or send harassing texts impersonating people sharing private information photoshopping pictures to cause humiliation cracking someone's password or hacking their account stealing people's credit cards and charging large amounts these things are illegal you might end up in prison don't snapchat while you drive it might impair your vision don't be a grouchy grump or a misanthropic chump say nice things on the internet don't be like donald trump politics on facebook can be so polarizing when friends and family start to post opinions so surprising don't enter in the flame war
Yo, what's happening? Get my music player turned back up. People online, a good friend is what you might find. You gotta be kind to people online. Don't be a don't be a don't be a cyber bully. You gotta be kind to people online. A good friend is what you might find. How's that? Added a new audio and music player, so I'm checking the properties. Bear with me a second. Hey, what up, Ron? How you doing? How's everything sound? I added a music player hooked my audio out from the computer into my soundboard so I could try to balance everything better. So it's a process. How you living? Getting everything set up so we can have music playing in the a bit of a high-pitched whine. I have no idea where that might be coming from. That's annoying. Damn it. Is it still there? Huh, that's weird. I don't hear it on my phone, but I don't know how to get rid of it. Unless something's creating interference. Okay. Well, hopefully by this weekend we'll be able to figure it out. Um, hang on a second. Yeah, I don't know how to get rid of it. Because um, I have a monitor in studio now. So we can actually hear the music, and so when we get a telephone caller, we can hear the caller. Um, so I suppose I should get somebody to call me so I can test that too. pitch static sound. Did that help at all? Hopefully this doesn't hurt too bad.
doing it. Damn it. How's that? This is such a pain in the ass trying to get all this stuff figured out. I swear. Working on getting a new soundboard that uh, should make everything a little bit better. Hmm. I wonder if that's audio interference coming from the actual computer. But now, is the buzzing gone too? Before Lena Dunham was successful and paid, if the girl was on the L trying to find her way, well, if the girl grew up and got her MFA, married with the mortgage and the may seem like a stupid question, but is breast milk vegan? Can I call you back in a bit? I have to Skype my lactation consultant. She looks so good when she shops organic, cause she cares about her baby and the future of our planet. But life has gotten hectic now that she's become a mom. Though the charter school waiting list isn't all that long, and the mandarin immersion that they offer every morning combines a bit of Waldorf and a bit of Montessori. And the rooftop playground has an urban petting zoo with recycled wood chips and a Manhattan view. Cause her green point stuff had to go. Is that better? Bedford got too crowded and she'd seen enough shows. So she married a designer and moved to Park Slope. I feel really bad nice going live and have people like to get on here and watch. Well, I'm trying to tune the audio. Doing great. Since Ellen Page Instagrammed her diaper bouquet Before the Starbucks down on Union sold soy lattes There was hipster girl trying to find her way Well, hipster girl grew up and got her MFA Married with the mortgage and an IRA Hybrid mini fed up in the car Whoops. The audio on this, uh, I'm using Buzz Rocks, or Pretzel Rocks, obviously. <clears throat> um, and on the app, on the desktop, it's, the volume is really touchy. Obviously. Obviously. 
No more TV on the radio, it's NPR. Where she heard the interview in her husband's car. With her ex-fiance who had gone EDM. But ever since her wedding, it was hard to stay friends. And his co hoodie with the dragonfly. She kept it in her closet as the years went by. Who's cried in that Yeah, I figured. <laughs> if, I had, if I had an audio player, at least you guys can... If I don't have anything to talk about, I'm just sitting here staring off in space. Oh, that's what's up. Yeah. I think this will work. So this weekend, um, we are planning, we're doing a marathon, and we're actually going to run 5 p.m. to, or 5 p.m. Friday, excuse me, 5 p.m. Friday to 5 p.m. Sunday. We're going to do 48 hours straight. I'm just working on getting all of the volume set. Have you seen Blackfish? It is so sad. There is no way we are ever And I think, like, I, I plugged in my phone to the audio board, and I have a splitter, so the mic can go out and the headset can go in. So whoever calls can hear all of us through the mixer board. Um, and then we can hear the caller's voice through my monitors in studio. Um, so getting a fair balance to where we can actually hear the caller and not have too bad of an echo is going to be, it's a pain in the ass. And then when I, obviously when I plug my phone in, there's some sort of electronic interference that's creating an audio loop. I think that's what that noise was from. And I turn, I even turned that channel all the way down. I'm going to plug it back in and see if it happens again. Man, if you could bring us some Rockstar and some snacks, that would be lovely. Obviously, we're going to be taking shifts. Um, mainly me, Sean, Michael, and Anthony. I'm going to try to hang as much as I can. But it's going to be tough. Is that noise back? I like having this music player. A lot of people aren't going to like the fact that it scrolls the now playing in chat, but I don't mind at all. Okay, it's not back. So I bet if I go up on the audio, it will come back. But I'll have to figure that out tomorrow. Um, if you know anybody that has a desktop phone, like an old school office phone that has an audio jack on it, a three-way, you know, like you plug a headset into it that has splits off into a microphone and a headset. That's what we need. I have a Darth Vader speakerphone that I was trying to use, but it's too old. I think the jack is only a one-way jack on it. And it picks up radio interference when I try to mess with it. So, pain in the butt. You know, one thing I should do, though, play a web video and see if uh, the audio is too loud on it. Uh, we don't even need a multi-line phone line. All we need is one that has a, a jack on it that we can plug a uh, splitter in. Yeah, I went to uh, Goodwill the other day trying to find one and they had nothing. So, kind of suck. I'm going to play a, play a video from Chrome and see if it does it. You should change the font of the intro thing to the Arf which keys. Yeah, I'm gonna do that. Yeah, I'm gonna do that. 
Okay. Change it to R from which come with Quanch, Quanch keys. Okay. I sent you the link. Okay. The, down, download the font. It's your machine. I will. Bro. Is that, too that font is too generic. You know what it reminds me of? It reminds me of, like... Uh, what's that one dude that does the, the, the YouTube show? Oh, there's two dudes that do that. that ridiculousness. Have you seen their font? It's so generic. Ridiculousness? Yeah, that show. No, I've never seen it. You've never seen Ridiculousness? No. Well, our shit's way more funnier. But, um, who's that other guy? The gay guy. Trevor? No, no, no. no. The gay guy that, he has a TV show that, on Comedy Central. And they do YouTube. He just does YouTube clips. And makes, he finds stupid stuff on YouTube and makes fun of it. Oh, uh, what the fuck is his name? Um... Uh, I know you're talking about. How's that volume? I actually wasn't drunk at all. We stayed up all night long name? working on some stuff. He, he, he reminds me of a young Tom Green. He's just yeah. dumb. It's like four years old. Like, like that, that logo thing, thing reminds me of his show, show too. A little bit, yeah. Yeah. Maybe. It's, it's too, too generic. Funk Shop TV, TV is, is the most original, original thing on YouTube, YouTube. So, so we have to make, like, keep everything change the font of the art. Munchka, 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 and cheese. We're playing an internet clip. Really? Yeah, that's, that's the name of the font, bro. <laughs> Look at the link I sent to your Facebook. That font is dumb. In-house monitor. Fuck. Well, all right, that's it's gonna be like twelve hours to change in that font. How's it gonna take you twelve hours to change one font? Because it's difficult. How, it is not difficult. Bro. I've seen the stuff that you do. It's not difficult. <laughs> all right. Well, we'll change it Look, at some point. Right now it is six forty-nine a.m. We've, We've been, been sitting here dealing with this stuff for hours just to, to make Kevin, Kevin look good. good. He's, He's always, always complaining that he looks black or, or white, whatever. <laughs> we can't tell. We don't know what he is. So we've just spent the last few hours trying to make Kevin look good because he says that this show isn't going to give him any pink taco because we always make him look bad. So the next video that you're going to see coming soon... As a video with Kevin, he's, he's running some errands for us, he's doing some nice things for us, because we've been sitting here for hours, and hours, going over video, and trying to make him funnier so you guys can enjoy this stuff. And I'm sorry the logo, the, the intro page, the little sweeper thing, it's so generic, but it's because Sean's too lazy to change the font to the Arp Munchka Munchka Nunchka Cheese. That's, That's the name of the font. So if you try to copy us, you have to type in Arf Munchka Munchka, munchka, and cheese. That's, That's how you find it. it. Okay. <laughs> yes. Ah, got it. Awesome. If it wasn't, wasn't for this stuff, stuff this show, show probably, probably would, would not air. It, it wouldn't be on YouTube. Yeah, this is when we were it wouldn't make it any footage anywhere. for season one. <laughs> we, we would just be like, Trevor, that you're going to see in another video where he turns, turns into a human coffee table. <laughs> That's, that's coming soon. soon. <laughs> <laughs> We'd be like him if we didn't have this stuff. Because this keeps us going so we can entertain you people. Funk Shop TV, yo. They call me Biggs, and we'll see you soon. So, Funk Shop... Yeah, so is the audio okay on that? Did you hear any echo or any like background noise? Uh, even after I turned it down, it was too loud. God, I got my gains all the way down on that, too. Okay. Alright, let's see how this one. On TV World, we just spent like. Change it to Arf Munch 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 Keys. Okay. Call me Biggs, and we'll see you soon. Is that better? So, Funk Shop TV World, we just spent like four hours, kind of maybe five. It's been a long, 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 long morning. Putting together the video for Funk Shop TV. 
And how's that? Is that better? I was getting a whole bunch of stuff done and making it funny for you guys to enjoy life a little bit and have something to laugh at. Sean, Mr. Rainey, the sausage king, the king of the dog, put some wording in the wrong place on the video and then rendered it down so you could view it. So now I have to go through and redo it and spend like another two and a half hours just to fix that problem. After we've already spent four fucking hours working on this shit. Video volume. So I tell you, man, it, I hope you realize how much effort is going into this. Because we're working our asses off to bring you something to laugh at. How's wait, that? Wait, wait, what are you. Hey! Whoa! I'm telling you, what are you doing, man? <laughs> Hours and hours going over video and trying to make them funnier so you guys can enjoy this stuff. And I'm sorry the logo, the, the intro page, the little sweeper right, thing reason, is so generic, but it's because Sean's too lazy to change the font to the Arp Munchka Munchka Nunchka Cheese. That's the name of the font. So if you try to copy this, you have to type in Arf Munchka 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 Cheese. That's how you find it. Well, for some reason, my audio setting, <laughs> I want my yes. audio setting for the mic. Awesome. If it wasn't for this stuff, this show probably would not air. It wouldn't be on YouTube. You know what? I know why. It wouldn't make it anywhere. <laughs> we would just be like, Trevor, that you're going to see in another video where he turns into a human coffee table. <laughs> that's coming soon. <laughs> we'd be like him if we didn't have this stuff. Because this keeps us going so we can entertain you people. Funk Shop TV, yo. They call me Biggs, and we'll see you soon. Did that, did that even change? All right. God, so, Funk shocked. Shop TV world, we just spent like four hours, kind of maybe five. It's been a long, 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 long morning. Putting together a video for Funk Shop TV, and... After getting a whole bunch of stuff done and making it funny for you guys to enjoy life a little bit and have something to laugh at, Sean, Mr. Rainey, the Sausage King, the King of the Dog, put some wording in the wrong place on the video and then rendered it down so you could view it. So now I have to go through and <laughs> no, redo it and spend like another two and a half that. hours just to fix that problem. After we've already spent four fucking hours I don't, I don't working like, on this shit. I don't like shit. guinea pig, dude. I don't so like I tell you, man, they, I hope you realize how much effort is going into this. Because we're working our asses off to bring you something Nothing wrong with to laugh lucky. at. Wait, wait, what are you... <laughs> hey, whoa. <laughs> I'm telling you, what are you doing, man? <laughs> Alright, I have an idea. Hang on. Yo. Hello? And even though Rock and Roll is completely online, never alone. So, if you need help or if you have questions, you can always call or check the home. Hello? Can you hear me? They're really with you. Every step of the way. Rocket Mortgage, America's largest mortgage lender. Now the shit's about to kick off, this party looks whack Let's take it back to straight hip hop and start it from scratch shit. I'm about to bloody just check up everybody Um Yeah, I know Yeah, can you still hear the, hear the background music at all, though? Probably not, now that I turn that down. Okay. 
a new jam, call it fresh preserves. How's that? Without bread, you can spread the word. Box alley on the rise, you can press the shirt. You got a fair amount of flavor, get your chest desserts. Do it for the well educated and illiterate. Real in the nonsense, conscious. See, the, the hard part, I have to go into the audio pro properties in the actual computer and figure out the balance between the sound card and the desktop output. So it's a pain in the ass. Yeah, it's um we've Funk Shop TV has has been doing this for about four years, but this is the first season that we've done on Twitch. And me personally doing this, um about two weeks. I think. Ron, when did I call you about the monitor question? Oh, tonight? Thirty two minutes. So I've been spending 32 minutes trying to balance audio properties. We're doing a 48-hour marathon this weekend, so I have to get everything set so we have a music player. Um, for music, we use Pretzel Rocks um, because you cannot play copywritten music without getting in trouble or without getting muted. We use either Pretzel Rocks or pull up another Twitch, like one of the Twitch music accounts to play music through. Hopefully they're going to put together a Twitch music player app soon. But we cannot take requests. That sucks, I know. Being a DJ and not being able to play the music I want to play, it, <laughs> it pisses me off. Trust me. Like, I really thought about putting together a website and start a petition to, like, for the powers that be to leave DJs alone. We should be able to have a mix show and not have it muted, but, um, no, we don't have to, you don't have to have a license for Pretzel. For what Pretzel did was go and collect all the licensing for the music that you hear to be able to, for it to be used on Twitch specifically, so anybody can use it as their music player without getting banned or muted because they already have all of they collect basically they collect all of the, in, the uh, rights for you or the permissions in order for it like if I wanted to play a Bubba Sparks song I'm personally friends with Bubba Sparks but if I wanted to play his entire catalog I could get his permission but I would also have to get the permission of the record labels that put out the music that those that's on whatever album like if I wanted to play Miss New Blue, I would have to get Bubba's permission, I would have to get the publisher's permission, permission, and I would have to get Interscope's permission because Interscope put the album out. Um, so imagine if I had to go in and get permission like that for every song I wanted to play, it wouldn't be worth it. So yeah, you, on, my, on my personal channel, um, I'm going to start setting up the turntables and mixing live um, with like a, a camera close up on my hand so you can see that I'm actually using turntables. And I'm gonna start mixing like that until I'm, you know, I'm gonna go on for a couple hours a week um, until they tell me not to. I'm gonna start doing that Monday. Right now I'm just trying to get all of our audio properties level so they're enjoyable to our viewers because of this 48 hour marathon that we have coming up. Ron, if you have some time, maybe you can come by and help me with the uh, the audio settings and make just kind of look through everything and make sure I have everything set up properly. What I need to do, I've got one of these gaming keyboards. Uh, it's a Logitech G15, <clears throat> so I need to learn how to put assign buttons on. Uh, figure out how to put 
the sign buttons on it so I can control the mute and uh, control the audio properties for the sound player so when we actually are playing a video. Yeah, I like the keyboard. I just don't know how to um, pull up the keyboard properties because there, there's a few extra buttons. I guess you can direct them to do what you want. So I want one of these buttons to be able to be a pause button. So if we play a video clip, we can pause the audio in the background so it's not overplaying the video clip. That's my hope. Yeah, that. <laughs> See, I'm not a computer tech guy, dude. I'm a, I'm a DJ. I'm a turn table tech guy. But I have learned my way around Twitch okay, and I'm still learning. I've been doing a lot of research. It's not easy. Getting around all the copyright laws is what bothers me the most, I think. Nothing I can do about that, it's America. It's not quite as free as they make it, make it sound. Ron, I appreciate that. Definitely appreciate that. And again, man, if you, like, you're my homie. If you ever, ever want to get to a point where you, you're like, man, I want to have my own talk show. We have all the equipment here. See, I've learned how to move the cameras around and stuff. I can tilt and zoom and I can pan. Um, but you can come over and use my gear anytime you want. Come use the studio. That's what it's here for. Bro, I will teach you how to spin. You help me get this stuff dialed in, I will teach you how to spin. I'll teach you how to beat match, I'll teach you how to scratch. I can do that. If, if honestly, if I could, man, I was, I've got countless hours of mixes that I need to edit. And I would love to put some editing software on this computer, pull it up full screen, and go through Pro Tools or whatever editing software I decide to use to edit my mixtapes to make sure that all that audio is balanced and to put in CD track, you know, track breaks where I want them to be. Um, I would love to be able to do that while I'm sitting here live on Twitch and showing people, you know, this is how you take an audio track and this is how you take change levels and balance stuff out and you want to create a loop or an echo. But everything I'm doing, it, it, everything I have to do is, like I literally have probably 300 hours of of mixes, recorded mixes that I should edit. Because um, every time I play somewhere, I record it, I record it live, and it goes on a sound card, and then I just dump it in a folder to clear the sound card when I'm done. So it, I would love to be able to go through all of those and then listen to them, chop them up, edit them, and then just play them through in the background as I'm talking. I would love to play my own mixtapes, but I can't because Twitch will mute me. I was using Magic Mix Studio and I'm self taught I'm not familiar with Magic Mix Studio, but I assume it's like, kind of like Virtual DJ. Yeah, if you have original music, that'd be dope too. I, we can play that. I think I'm, I might even put, in, put a shout out to all of the artists I know and, and start collecting all original stuff. And, uh, Stand here, stand here and do mixes with that stuff. And they can't blank me if there's no copyright tag on it. Okay. That's what's up. Sean's really good with uh, audio software. He makes beats. He's got a whole studio. I'm surprised he's not in here chatting. Sean wants me to start getting into video editing now that I have an i7 machine, but I want to learn some aspects of like After Effects, 
but I really don't have a whole lot of desire to um, don't have any desire to like make make movies and stuff. I'll leave that up to the people that like doing that stuff. Like Sean. I want to make beats. I want to get a machine. Machine. And when I get a machine, then I can sit here and play with the machine all day and make make my own beats live. I don't mind doing that. Maybe I could start a channel where I I start playing with the machine and people that know what they're doing have have used it before can go into chat and tell me what I should be doing. Dude, Roland 808. Uh, 808 just made a DJ 808, so it's like a DJ controller with the two jog wheels on it. I personally hate controllers because I'm so old school and I'm a, I'm a turntable purist. But Roland made a DJ controller with the 808 built into it, so it's not only a DJ controller with the wheels. It has the 808 eight buttons at the top so you can drum and create loops as you're, as you're mixing. I thought about getting one of those. Um, maybe. You know, if it gets to a point where I can't lug turntables around anymore, because they're heavy, can't buy the needles that I use that I prefer anymore because Shure doesn't make needles anymore. They just stopped about a year ago. Um... You won't hang on a second. Don't post anything. I think you're safe. No mistake, it was all by design The way that I combine words you can't define Music is something that you can't confine So don't try to box me in like an alpine can I think you're good. You, you, you should be able to post a link. It's not right, that's the reason that I do this Play my part, I'm in the heart of a movement to show Can we just react to videos instead of songs? Even if, if like if I did like a ridiculousness type format and pulled out videos from YouTube and played them through here, they could, they, I could even get in trouble for that. So sometimes we'll pull, pull like, what up, Michael? Uh, sometimes I'll play like a. Uh, videos from YouTube or videos from news channels, but they get pretty picky about that too. Yeah, life. Day yeah. by day, I hit you with the play by play. Say grace, give thanks for what I ate on my plate. Shows yeah. rapping, cause yeah. I need a way to relate. Yeah. And I don't think I made a mistake. What can you say to replace the one place that is safe to escape? Space on these CDs and tapes. Okay. MCs might check, but I might check mate. Michael just got here. I got high tech traits. So he's gonna come down so we can try to mess with the phone properties and see if we can get it to work. Like wet planks to the next date. I'ma let the rest wait. Cause the rest late, just like the West. So simply complex, but it all connects. Um, you were blind and I called your bets. And I'm fine with the small For the marathon, we're gonna be talking about a whole lot of stuff. Back and forth, forth and back. Talking about sports, talking about politics, talking about music. It's my friend's music, rock band from 2000 era, Vancouver, Portland based. Okay, I think you told me about that. So we can probably play this without getting in trouble. Let me uh, tr transition. Is there a copyright on it? Can we play it without getting in trouble? Stop our music player. Picking up my thumb, something wicked this week. Uh, okay. <laughs> Good. Oh, it is licensed. Yeah. 
We could still get it, still get booted for it. It's the shitty thing with licensing, man. I hate it. Unless it says royalty free, we're really not allowed to play it. One thing that I really do like though, I don't know if I can play it while I'm on Twitch. One of my favorite, like, I really don't even listen to the radio very much when I'm sitting at home. I'll pull up this and let it play. So I'll call it. I'll wait until after the stupid commercial is done. There we go. So this should be legit to be able to play. Last time I wrote a song like this, I was drunk off the last words out of your lips, and what a world! You were always looking for attention, and I was holding on to my abandonment. And I know some people that work for Rhyme Sayers, so I should just get all the Rhyme Sayers. Um, we host Rhyme Sayers, so anytime that, like, if, even if we're not on Funk Shop TV, you can go on to Funk Shop TV's um, Twitch channel. Chances are Rhyme Sayers music is playing. Everything is on my fault. No sacrifice. I should have known that you were trouble from the start. Red but again, even if I'm wanted to floor, do a whole Rhyme Sayers DJ set, I, wanted, I, I would have to get a permission from the label, demon. permission from the artists. Just because when I DJ, I'm manipulating it live. So if you change something and remix something, you still have to have permission. It's stupid, man. The rules are ridiculous. I hate it. If the girl I run with is treating me cool, bugs the shit out of me. Fucking gotta be kidding me. Look at all that you did to me. Why the hell would you be wondering who's kissing me now? Fucking gotta be kidding me. Look at all that you did to me. Why the hell would you be wondering who's kissing me? Sorry if I'm boring you guys, but if you're watching at 12.30 in the morning Pacific time, chances are you're bored anyways. So, I've been playing with audio settings and trying to make sure that all of our microphones are balanced. We're ready to roll for this 48-hour marathon this weekend. Wish I had uh, some graphic and graphic software on here so I can, Because I'm going to make a graphic and do a Facebook event invite. Try to get as many people viewing as possible. So Ron, if you, if you like, can do us a favor, pull up, get anybody with a whole bunch of computers and have them all pull up. Whatever they can and make a whole bunch of Twitch accounts and view us. You can only view two Twitch accounts per IP though. I used to act like a fool. Oh yeah. now I hear that you wondering. Moderators Nightbot, Funk Shop TV. It's treating me cool. You fucking gotta be kidding me. Look at all that you did to me. Why the hell would you be wondering who's kissing me now? You fucking gotta be kidding me. Look at all that you did to me. Why the hell would you be wondering who's kissing me We're all fine. We're not. Gotta be kidding me. Look at all that you did to me. Why the hell would you be wondering who's kissing me now? Fucking gotta be kidding me. Look at all that you did to me. Why the hell would you be wondering? 
<laughs> proliferate the punk shop. It's that's the idea, man. We uh we're gonna do everything we can to. We're not offline, you jerk. I, like I don't understand how any of this stuff works. I still have to figure this out. Anthony dropped off as a subscriber, you jerk. Ah, uh, now we're live. Yeah. Um, we're actually going to set a schedule that like daily so I'm like heads locally approach all spark plugs total this one day we're gonna do one thing another day we're gonna do post no, another thing. pretty tunks in a track said he wants pale horse painted gun metal black face masking pork shell ebony propeller hat clumpins club and I think we pretty much got it down but a steel so metal gate spread him put a dead alive yeah when it it's pork stop it's dope 37 2000 out the weekly under cycles to Gehenna gets him floating over 20 buses fireproof and festive corners like a you know, I heard that Aesop moved to Portland. Um, so does Apache. I don't know if you remember Apache from uh, Punk Dubious. Yeah, they're all dope. Um, AC alone is absolutely one of my favorite lyricists. Gangway, mine, eyes, mine, teeth. Completely. Gangway, mine, eyes, mine, teeth. The man I gotta find where I put this uh, schedule. Because I forgot to copy and paste it. And lose it. Grace, guy, you're in man rank. Crammed in a one player campaign. Flicker like a hollow bonfire over Sam Haynes. Span with a praying hands, man. They bars an extension of the arms. They're mutating instead of being farmed. Tonight beneath the marmalade Venus. Wanted mowers chewing every Like me and Tyler Quelly spent a lot of time talking about West Coast hip hop. And how. Like gangster rap got so so big that underground hip hop, like real West Coast hip hop, isn't very well known on the West Coast, but it is everywhere else. So like, if you go to Germany or go to Amsterdam, you go to London, and you talk about American hip hop, a lot of people like one of the top ten, top twenty groups is Hieroglyphic Jurassic Five, Dilated People. But in the West Coast, it's Gangway, Mac Dre and <laughs> stuff like that. So, Gangway, what do you do, eyes, right? Ah, oh, you son of a bitch! Da 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 da. Ba da ba da ba ba ba. Less of an act of hubris, more lonely hearts club at the helm of a magic bullet. Away on a relentless bid for rarefied inertia, rattle trap. Hieroglyphics definitely is one of the best hip hop bands um, or hip hop groups. As far as bands, I would have to say um, the Roots, hands down. But like lyrical, lyrical, lyrical groups, personally, and this is gonna make a lot of people mad. I put hieroglyphics above Wu Tang. I mean, it, it's like this, but, like, if, you, if, if I had the option to go on tour with Hieroglyphics or to go on tour with Wu-Tang, I would pick Hieroglyphics. I'm gonna give 
and Rhyme Sayers, this channel plays a lot of atmosphere. I had the pleasure of meeting Lyric Warner and his wife because I was friends with Rhyme Sayers. Oh, I think we had this talk. Like, I used to rock same underneath here all the time back in the day. I think we talked about that. And that's when I was doing a lot of stuff with uh, when I was managing 13th floor, House of Graves. And I brought Dell and Opio and Casual out here. I would still rock it if I could find it. Like Ryan used to, like I'd be DJing places and, or I'd have to throw a show, host a show at House of Grooves and Ryan would bring me some gear just to let him and his crew in. We'd hang up banners and stuff for him. We supported Sam underneath a lot. It's so nice sitting here having music playing in the background now. I'm looking for my other Facebook to see if I can find it. Same underneath the shirt. She got to touch it. She want to hold it. She gets focused. She got the dopest kiss. She don't need you to talk. I found some pictures of uh, DJ Spark. Because Spark was a funk shop DJ a while ago. I found some pictures of him and uh, Charlie Tuna hanging out in downtown Portland. She the opposite of selfish. She love house pets. She want to help kids. She pulled me out my shell. Fit tight like a belt. Not a sucker. Here's one. Believe it, don't get sweeter. She gonna make me sweat like fever. She wanna eat, so we went to Dominguez. She wanna ring, got me measuring the fingers. If she want it, I'm gonna give it up. If she run it low, I'm gonna fill her cup. If it's spilled, chill, I'ma clean it up. I'll be right here, cause she's enough. If she needed the money, I would stick you up. If she getting bored, I do some different stuff. That was... Don't need anything, just keep it up. I'll be right here, cause she's enough. And one mix, when I was on the end, one mixtape tour um i want to say 2003 2004 ish and that's octane on the right and alamo on the left i was on a national with them actually i went uh, i was on the n1 mixtape tour for 2004 and 2005 Oh, that's dope. That, that, that's a fresh lineup. But you can see, you can see, dude. Same underneath, right there. I'm not shit. I'm champagne. Let's all go home, kill ourselves in our radios. Where's my head? This is in line. Nobody loves a thing. Everyone is fucking crazy in control. It's not my fault. That's home. DJ Dirty. Don't be sorry once I skip. And I'm scared to life. Uh, a pain DJ Puma death. and sure my ex-wife's kid. Right away. When I, I had M1 in town from loud. Uh, Dead all Press. All my ideas become perfect little blind spots for me. I was the one that took the camera, so I, I couldn't get into that shot. It was me and Casual. For evidence. From dilated people. Somewhere around here I got a picture with Casual, but I don't know what's on. I don't even know if it's on, on a Facebook or I have to actually find the digital copy somewhere. There's Merce. Merce and Shock G. Isn't it neat? Dude, we could, we, like, we have music playing. There's no hill more harsh than the memory. There's no home more hell than the empty nest. Winter takes the warm away. Spring takes the cold away. Summer takes the rain away and fall to the way, my friend. I believe there's never a place better than right where you are. Oh, well, imagine if it's afterlife can tend to mend a broken heart over someone dead. It's a way of coping with loss. But I don't need you out there somewhere if I have you in my thoughts. I don't envy anyone in a position where the force of truth. Yeah, bus drivers don't too. 
I mean, I know you're sick, you're tired, and confused. But yeah. Sometimes letting the right. tired go to sleep is a mistake. I will hold your head while the doctor sits the needle in. I'll always remember our companionship and what it meant. How about this? There's the same underneath shirt. Sunday, October the fifth. With Rozelle and the DJ JS one. <laughs> Obviously from 2000. Um, and on that show, that, that picture was actually Eugene, Eugene. I did Portland, Eugene, and Seattle on that show. And Ugly Duckling was the opener. What up, Mike? I don't know if you're Mike's name. Okay. Oh, it's muted. What's up? It's been half. Super hot. No, it's showing. Mike test. Mike one two three one two two three three three. Is it good? Good. Check 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 check. You're definitely louder. Louder than I am. Not me, cause I'm actually closer now. <laughs> Ron said, welcome to the Cool Kids Club, Michael. The Cool Kids Club? Oh, sweet. I'm in the Cool Kids Club now? So what I did uh -huh. is ran an audio line out from the computer into the soundboard. Okay. So all audio now, we can, like if I play a video clip on here, mm -hmm. we hear. Okay. Oh, that's cool. Yeah. So if we ever go through like a news clip or something, everybody's going to hear it. I can't get it any louder than that without it overbearing it right here. And get that feedback. Until we get another shooting. All right, another mixer. Once we get the other mixer, I'll have a lot more control. Yeah. Yeah, yeah. It's, it's mainly just for the sound of control. Yeah. I mean, we can still hear that. Once nobody's like over-talking, da 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 you can't hear that. I wish. Um, Ron, are you watching on your phone or on the computer? Little fuckers fighting, mother hiding in her hulu. I'm climbing up the stucco. Let's get to the sepulchre. Uh oh, that pretty penny turned a prickly in the Benji. If you save up all your winnings, then you get to keep So, you still have a problem with uh, the phone? The phone line. The yes and no. Like, once we get a different phone, the fuck? Uh -huh. it won't be as bad. Okay. But I think because on a cell phone, because it has audio talk pro properties in it, like yeah. you can give it voice commands. The microphone is constantly looping. Okay. So I think that's creating an audio feedback loop. Ron said I have an idea. What's your idea? You first. Because I was going to have you call my phone and see if she we can do a I'm test audio live like on a test phone chemistry. call. Anthony tried to call, and that's when I turned the channel on. Now that Mike is sitting there, we can get more, more control over my barber look. I'm not good at this. I grew up in a noogie fest. You built your walls up higher, said goodbye to all your cookie puss. Here's one. Every time yeah, go ahead and call me. You got my number, right? I see images of hooded riders setting fire to hundreds. She said, when you start getting all expressive and symbolic, it's impossible to actualize an honest diagnostic. I said, when you start getting all exact and algebraic, I'm reminded it's a racket, not a rehabilitation. Okay. Agree to this. Dude, I've been making like so many more scenes. Oh, well. Preservation is a doozy. Will you be Yeah, I've noticed that more and more stuff is absolutely I'm shrunk. Coming up. Yeah. <sighs> Just another day at work. Still working on uh, putting up displays and mods. So it's been kind of slowish, but kind of okay. Yeah. 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 Yeah.
Grass is hot as snakes that'll bite up your head sometimes. If you ain't aware of awake, you must have been sleeping, you must have been dreaming. No, there ain't no mistake. Be aware, be awake, be awake. Yeah. The grass is hot as snakes that'll bite up your head sometimes. If you ain't aware of awake, you must have been sleeping, you must have been dreaming. No, there ain't no mistake. You're perfect just the way you are. Nothing out of the ordinary, no Tom and Jerry shit. Flip the ass off my cigarette and give it back to the earth. Ooh. Winston Kane, Winston Kane. I say you're perfect just the way you are. Good. Nothing Good. out of the ordinary, no Tom and Jerry shit. Flip the ass off my cigarette and give it back to the earth. for you yeah bring it down I want you to work your way out upon that limb as far as you can if you see anything strange let me know without the punk smooth it goes one two you gone through where we come through hit undo whatever you must do stay fly get high and fuck you them bell boys the back them boys the summer and this time your boy ace rock is the drummer so tell the newcomers to run and get the other two i heard we sold out that must have been the other two nobody moves nobody loses blood whoever souped you up should take you back to booster club go ahead loosen up a couple blues must have grew a sense of humor because you used to be a super thug we still speak Spitting on the indie bullshit. Let this rhyme say it's deaf just the full clip. We don't miss. We ain't for the you heart. Your favorite group that Check wasn't up. even a group to start. Okay. I tried to tell them, but they wasn't trying to listen to me. Did you hear me at all when I uh, there was no other choice? I had to tell them give it to me. Give it to me. I tried to tell them. No, I know you hear me. Did you hear me on the phone? Listen to me. I keep this simple, but right now I wanna kick in yo. Everything you love about rap in one disc These internet rappers just beef over dumb shit We all about the cash, we all about the women What up though? You know we can't forget them But How don't you think we saw for one minute We could still break your whole crew off with one sentence Who makes you wanna again. rap and be independent? It's felt motherfuckers if you wanna come and get it Who's this? If the new shoe fits, I'll take two kicks Truth is without new hits Hey, what up? Can you hear me now? Now I hear you. How well can you hear me? Put his ear into the mic. Oh, he needs to mute his channel. He was like... Hold on, hold on. You hear the music. How well do you hear the mic? I don't hear him. Um, 
hang on, hang on, hang on. How about now? What just happened? Because we had him. Talk to him. Hello? Hello. Can you hear us? Can you hear me? Test. Test. Test him. Ron? Hello? Seriously. Can you hear me? Yeah, I can hear you. Can you hear me? I can hear you. Can you hear me? Yeah, I can hear you. Can you hear me now? Yeah, I can also hear myself. Ooh, can you hear me now? Yeah. Can you hear yourself now? Um, yeah, but it's tolerable. You probably turn that down just a little bit, maybe. Just like, you yeah. know, just so maybe. Well, the challenge is we have to hear We have to make sure that this is loud enough to where we all can hear it. Yeah, but you don't want it to work. How about now? I still hear you. But can you I hear still hear me. You can still hear It's kind of like calling a radio. Oh. That's kind of what it's supposed to be like. Yeah. Um... Okay. What Lewis? about hearing himself on the computer? Yeah, how about hearing yourself on a computer? How's that? Uh, yes, I can because I've got my headphones next to my head and I can hear it coming through five, seven seconds later. Okay. How's the audio level? How's the audio level? Of your call. Hold on. Of, of your call. Sounds good. What about uh, on, on your call? On from the phone, right? Paul? Yeah. Phone well, sounds phone. good on the phone and the headphone. Okay. So the only thing is just that he can hear himself a, a bit, but not too bad, though. Seems like it. And uh, the hearing himself is just probably hearing him through the monitors. Why Why does it seem like I'm coming through the, on the mm -hmm. monitor? Right. Even, Aha. You can even probably turn down the volume on my call just a hair because I'm almost louder than you guys. Can you hear us now? Can you can you hear Paul? Yeah, I can hear you guys. How about now? Can you hear me on the phone? No, I can't hear you guys on the phone. You cannot? Yeah, it seemed like, it seemed like there's a delay on there. How about now? Now I can hear. Okay. So here with the switch. That doesn't make any sense. That's weird to me. Because the submaster out should be just for the submaster output. That shouldn't have anything to do with the inline going into him. Right. Unless I hook these up backwards. Son of a bitch. Are you going to try switching two weapons? Camera's still on me or you? I Both of us. Okay. It's still on public enemy. Oh, oh shit! I didn't. I didn't oh, switch. You still have to uh, the triple. My bad. I didn't transition. There you go. So sub out should be the mic in, which is this one. Headphone should be able to into the board. This is really freaking bizarre. <laughs> so bizarre. So bizarre. You can hear me okay though? Yeah. Yeah, he said everything's fine. The only thing is that he can hear himself just a little bit. Like, tolerable. That's the only thing. Okay. <clears throat> Pretty loud comes on my side for myself. But I'm used to it from calling radio stations and whatnot, so. Well, your, your signal's pretty loud um, coming in. So I'm trying to balance our monitor with you at the same time. That's the Yeah, there's not much on my side I can do. Right. <laughs> How's your audio there? Uh, which side for the phone or my headphones? To the, we can hear that. To, you, to your phone. Audio to the phone. You're you're good. Yeah. See that sounds. But if I kill your submasters, 
Okay, how how's that sound? Can you hear me? You're quiet. Quiet. Oh, okay, you turned that down now. But that shouldn't make any difference. Right. See, that's a little bit louder now. Is that it's that? louder just to the monitor. Yeah. Because you're going yep. to the submaster. A right? lot louder on my side. Yeah, just because of that one switch. This does not make any sense. What about now? Can you hear? What about now? I can hear. Ooh, I heard a bit different than that one. How about now? How's that sound? Um, too quiet. Too quiet? Shit! It's, it's that one switch still. <laughs> what about that off and then turn that one up? I mean, you know it? That's just a little too loud, but at least you're audible. To be no how about now? How does that sound? That's good. Did the volume come down? Did the volume come down a bit? Uh, just a hair. Yeah, and it sounds a lot more audible for you coming through and for the feedback for my own voice. Okay. So, how does that sound? Is it quieter? Is it tolerable? It's a little quieter than when it first started out. It sounds tolerable. I can hear you good. The feedback coming through from what I'm talking to you is not over there. Okay, so I think yeah, I think that's where it, on that one it sounds well, right. This is the out to the phone. Yeah. This is all out to the to the master to our That one. Uh -huh. That and then that. That's nice. How does it sound now? No, I don't think you heard that. How that sound now? Mm. That sounds good. Oh, yeah. No, no, I'm not. What the fuck? Because <laughs> you did that one switch. Do the monitor now? No, nope. nothing. But you can hear you okay. But you can hear me now, though. Is it okay? Yeah. Okay. So just that and then that. Can you still hear me now? Can you hear yeah, me now? Yeah, you're you're not as clear as you were before. You're oh, I'm super over there. Okay. Yeah, I heard, I heard that. Is that you super over there? Yeah. How about now? How about now? Uh, I'm not over there. How about now? No. You. You kind of sound like the oh, I know you're that now. Yeah, because you turned that one off, you couldn't hear me. <coughs> right. Hey, so he's overbearing? You said you were overbearing. How about now? I was. Still am. Still am. Mm. What does it sound like now? Yes. Yes. Uh, a little loud. A little loud? A little loud? Yeah. On, on yours or my mic? On my side. Oh. You guys, you're, you sound like you're in a hallway. Still? Is it, does it still sound I like it? Michael Todd. Does it sound like it now? Does it sound like we're in a hallway? You sound like you're kind of far away. Wow. Okay. What about mine? Paul sounds like he's right up on the mic. Yeah. My feedback volume is still pretty low. Oh, hard. I know why. Fuck. I don't know how I can, how we can fix this. I know exactly why, I just don't know how. How we can fix this. Sorry, I'm, I'm staring at the board right now and trying to figure out how to do the map behind this. <laughs> Pain in the ass. Because I only have a monitor out and a sub master out. We have the 
phone line running into a channel and I have a submaster out to the phone. So in order for you to hear our voices, we have to turn on the submaster. Well, if we turn on the submaster, it's always com it's also coming from the monitor. But you can hear us okay. Yeah. I think we're just gonna have to leave it like this. Yeah, until we get the board or we for the time being. Yeah. Just try to turn down the feedback volume for when I talk because it's almost overbearing. Like I gotta hold my phone away from my ear when I'm talking. Sure. Yeah. Got that this in here? Yeah. How's that? Is that any better? Uh, test. 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 That's not too bad. It's better than what's before. Bring it down. And find it yeah, keep talking until this one stops. Test. Test. Okay. That makes your voice real quiet in studio. So we Does it? Yeah, unless we have headphones on, it's gonna be hard for us to hear. But anytime we have a caller, we're all just gonna have to shut up and listen to whatever the caller is saying. Which is not a big deal. Um, for now, this will work. Instead of headphones, maybe you can find a way to set up a single small amplifier. Well, that's that's what I'm going to. I'm going to a, a bookshelf stereo that has an uh, audio line in. Because if we go to a powered speaker, it's going to create more electronic feedback. Yeah. What a pain in the ass. Mm -hmm. Alright, well, at least we know it works without that annoying buzz click pop sound. Yeah, that works. That might be a new beat now. Buzz click pop. Buzz, buzz click, click pop. pop. Buzz, buzz click pop. Pop. Yeah, pop. Alright, man. Oh, so my idea. Yeah. Um. I don't know if you're able to do it with your motherboard. On mine, I have three or four audio outs, and I can customize them, so I can separate each line out for a specific application if I want. So you might be able to set it up so you can have videos coming out through one, and you can run it to your monitor through one channel, and you can have uh, your whatever feed coming out through another cable and you run it through another channel on your monitor. I was playing with the EQ on the bookshelf stereo. So, run, run that by me one more time. I'm going to meditate. All right, so, you said you had audio coming out of your computer and it's probably coming out of one cord into a channel on your monitor, right? Correct, but it is a stereo. I do have a st split stereo, so I'm going into two inputs on my board and I have them panned left to right. Okay. And so all the audio coming into the computer is coming out of that one cable. Correct. On my computer, my motherboard would let me split different audio applications through different ports on my audio motherboard, or audio ports on my motherboard. Okay. So I could run my videos out through one, and another application out through another, so that way I could separate them. Okay. That way I could individually control volumes and with all the volume out of all the computer at once. And that way I could use the, or you could use the monitor to control the volume instead of going through the computer and controlling the volumes like you would. Got it. I think I can do that on here too. I just haven't, I don't know enough about it. I'll come out sometime and look at it and see what we can look Because I have, like, four different jacks. I have an LR, SL, SR, C-sub, and RLRR. Mm -hmm. A lot of different things on the motherboard, and uh, it has a audio controller, <coughs> doesn't it? Right. Because uh, it doesn't. I'll look in the costs of uh, 
aftermarket uh, audio card. Uh, that's re what we're using right now. Are you are using aftermarket? Yeah, we're using an audio box, USB 96. I'm not sure about the controller for it, so yeah. I, yeah, I just don't know enough about dialing in and splitting the properties, so. No problem. Okay. When, you, when you get a chance, you can come over and show me how to do it right. Will do. You're the best. Nah, yeah, that'd be awesome. Yeah. Okay. Yeah. I'm going to get some food. I'm hungry. All right, buddy. Eat some for me. All right. All right, man. Bye. Yeah. I like the background you got on there. Yeah. Uh, you want to bring it down to 16? Oh, we don't? Yeah. Yeah, anytime, uh, you want to move down the left here. I wonder, um, when you, when you're, uh, when you, uh, shit, hold on. When you play? Like when we go to Los Dos or, or wherever, uh -huh. next time you uh, go spin, I should probably use my camera to get a get a close up like this of you actually playing. Oh yeah. Of the record spinning, and then maybe we could put that up. Turn it into yeah. You yeah. Can, even with your phone, you could, there's like gift creator apps now. Okay. Um, yeah, we can do that. Yeah. Still. Uh, Check, check. Yeah, now we're not coming through on the end. Yeah. It's so weird. I think that once we get enough bits and money from all of this, our first one should be should be a board. We're already talking about it. Yeah, that should be our first one. Well, I was going to order one uh, this month, but yeah, I had to take care of my car. Yeah, oh, of course. You need as that. well as household bills. Yeah. Um. But yeah, that's my next project. And the board that we're looking at, I'll be able to, it's got different output lines, um, but it also has auto-tune. Okay, oh, cool. So we can sit here and as long as we're talking, like talking in a vocal, we could be talking in a vocal tune and auto, auto, well, auto-tune will pick it up and auto-tune okay. our voices while we're, while we're live. Oh, cool, all righty. Yeah, I, I just think it'd be fun. Yeah, that would be. But I think it's also uh, got a direct USB out too, so we won't need the audio card. Oh, yeah, that might cut some of the, what, what do you call it? Uh, we'll get a cleaner sound. A cleaner sound, yeah, yeah, yeah. And it's microphone preamps. This doesn't have any microphone preamps, so that's why we have to have it so loud oh, for the microphones. Okay. But see how uh, quiet we have the computer line coming in? Right. But the microphones have to be way jacked. It's because the microphones aren't, there's no preamp power on this. Mm -hmm. And that one would have it. Right. Right. Uh, cool. Yeah, because everything has to, the, the microphones, everything has to feed through that and then come to this, right? It feeds through that and then that comes to the, uh, to the sound. Oh, uh, okay. So with the other board, it's going to just go straight to the board and then the computer. Right. So that's but like with this board. This board's just so old. That's why the no, volume yeah. level. See, the number one through five are microphones. Yeah, yeah, yeah. Okay. Uh, number fourteen and fifteen is the uh -huh. line in from the computer. All right. So I have look how high I have those plus the gains are this high. Yeah. The gains are almost all the way down in fourteen and fifteen, and the volumes are way down there. Just for that, yeah. Yeah. That's like cutting out the middleman. Right. <laughs> just straight there to there. Right. Yeah, that'd be good. Precisely. So I had a coworker. She comes up to me. It's really cool. She was like, she can be like a grandma, like the hell is cool as grandma. Okay. She comes up and she was like, so uh, what's your podcast about? And I'm like, how do you know? She was like, cause your name popped up, cause she's friends with me on Facebook. Okay. And she was like, your your uh, name popped up, and I'm like, what do you mean? She was like, yeah, it just says something. She she didn't specify. She just said my name just showed up. I'm assuming because I was tagged. And I was like, oh, because I got tagged in, in my other friend. She was like, yeah. So I tried to explain to her what it was about. And I mean, it's just random different things. And we'll talk about this, that, this, that, and stuff. And see, so how do I look it up and stuff? So you can go to Twitch. Twitch forward slash, or Twitch TV, uh, Twitch.tv forward slash phone shop TV. 
or you can just uh, that's like when we go live ours is live and I said or you can just go to YouTube and just look up Funk Shop TV all one word and you can look all the past seasons and the recent one on see and the one that we're doing now okay she's oh okay well that's cool and she said she'll look it up and you know and watch it and I said this Sunday got really heated so she was like so should I like not have people around me I was like it does say mature content but you know just watch it and then you can just go from there and I was like oh okay cool alrighty did you see the the uh, proposed schedule that no. I put up mm, that you put up on where in, the, in our group chat oh the Monday through Friday thing yeah yeah I just took a good glimpse of it that's, that's why uh I put in there, I was like, that's a good idea that we have a schedule. So, and in, in put it in the info down below. Yeah. So people can get, get a rough idea of when they can want to show up you or things like that. I think I'm going to switch. Thursday I have as Contemporary World News mm -hmm. and entertainment on Wednesday but I'm switching those two so you because you know more about like video games and movies than, than global issues. yeah so Thursday when you get off work you can headline the entertainment station yeah we could always go through TMZ and talk about who's doing what and who overdoses we stuff like that correct right yeah we can do that cool Sounds good. Pressure Rocks now playing No Doubt by Drew and the Joke. <laughs> yeah, we have the music player um, is. Let's see. Should have put it this time. So anytime you sit down here. Um, for control. Mm -hmm. There's icons on the right hand screen. There's the Streamlabs chat bot and Pretzel. Always gotta open those two before you go live. What was the first one? Streamlabs chat bot. Oh, chat, okay. Yeah. And then Pretzel. Pretzel's our music player. How'd you find that? How'd you come across I was it? I was doing a lot of uh, internet research on how we can get away with playing music and how we can get licensed to play music. If we wanted to play copyrighted music, like I could get all the permissions from Bubba Sparks to play every single one of his songs, mm -hmm. but I would have to go to the label and the publisher to get their permission as well. Yeah. So we'd have to have three or four different permission documents for each individual song we want to play. Right. Um, Pretzel Rocks is a website that's already done that for Twitch purposes, for streaming use. Oh. So they've already cleared it. They've already cleared it and got all the permissions to use whatever songs they have in their library. And they have different categories. Like there's an EDM category, a hip hop category. Oh, I guarantee 99% cool. of the music that's playing on here, we yeah. probably haven't heard yet. Um, like this one? <laughs> yeah. Yeah. That's cool. And this is just the instrumental of Dragon's Blood by MC Lars. And can you do a song request? Um, oh, you haven't said. The there's music? not a way to do song requests because okay. it's all. There's not pop music in it. Okay. So, so like, if you wanted to hear a ludicrous song, I guarantee you're not gonna. There's not gonna be a ludicrous song in their library. Right. Because they didn't go through all of the hoops. Like, they, they're connected with independent labels. Mm -hmm. So, the majority of the stuff that they're gonna have access to is stuff that isn't put on on a major label that doesn't have four or five different permission slips you have to obtain. Wow. Does that make sense? Yeah, yeah, it does. So yeah, if we okay. wanted to play Pitbull. There's probably six, five or six different permission slips we would have to use for each song yeah. we would want to play. Same with Sean Paul. Same with anybody else that's got a big name. Right. Um, we could get the permission from all of the artists directly, but that doesn't necessarily give us the rights to use the music. Right. It's stupid. Yeah, it is. Like, I would love to sit here and play all of Bubba Sparks' music in the background. I'd be all for it. Right. And even if Bubba said, yeah, Biggs, we've, we've been friends for 14 years, of course you can use my music. But we can send him a contract, he could sign it, but it doesn't necessarily mean that we could send it to Twitch and get the okay. Right. Because we don't have okay from the publisher. Or and the labels. The labels. Right. right. It's dumb. How's it sound? 
I can mute your mic if you want to. Oh no. Turn your, turn your phone. I just wanted to see how it, like how our how it sounded with that music playing. With the levels. Yeah. It should be fine. Rod and I tested it. Yeah, so, so far it is. Um, and that's another thing with when you pull up pretzel on here, mm -hmm. if you keep the volume at uh, 15 to 20 percent, should be fine. 15 to 20. All right. Yeah. Yep. And it's cool that. And if we're having an in-depth conversation, we'll just like, if there's multiple if, of us sitting here talking. Like Sunday. We just won't even pull it up. Yeah. yeah. But when we do this marathon. Oh yeah, you're gonna be hours mm, where it's yeah. just me or just you or just Sean. Right. Like, I mean, it's cool that uh, as the song playing, it tells you which one is playing. Yeah. Now playing drama bike instead of be like, hey, what song's playing? Oh, hold on. Right. Look it up. Okay. Uh, well, it, part of the agreement in, in enabling this music service is that it, it, you have to give it permission to post the. Um, yeah, which is cool, which is alright because then. I'm, whoever, yeah, I'm okay with it too. Yeah, because whoever's like watching. Huh? There's a lot of people on Twitch that don't like the, the chat feed being taken up by that. By them? Yeah. And I don't mind. Yeah, because then that way they, they don't have to ask you or they would put in there and they can, they can see that and then they can go and look it up and check it out themselves. Right. Okay, which is pretty cool. See, so we can pull up chatbot um, and go into our go into the commands and customize commands for everybody. Right. So anytime you're sitting here and if people are bored, you can just hit like I can I can do exclamation point Michael or Mike mm -hmm. um, or just exclamation point MC and then put it like Are you watching? Yeah. Did my my chat thing just pop up my Twitter link. Okay. Oh yeah, yeah. So I can set that up in uh, chatbot. So obviously it's the Funk Shop TV chatbot. Yeah, just like someone pointing the name. Yeah, yeah, they still have that. Cause I remember uh, when I was doing the the St. Jude uh, charity event. Uh -huh. That's how I had some of my stuff set up too. But mine was a simple little stuff because I only did it for thirty days. Right. With the St. Jude charity every year. And you can put in like follow me on Twitter, or you can type in exclamation point St. Jude, and it tells you. All that oh, kind of stuff. Yeah. yeah. Cool. But yeah, I still have to go through. You know, I'm going to do a form for everybody to fill out. Like mm -hmm. everybody on our cast with your Twitter, your email, whatever information you want out there. Right. So when I do the, the uh, chatbot commands for yeah. everybody. And you, you can have that automated too. Like every 10, 20 minutes. Yeah. The chatbot will pop up by itself. There's one. Uh. You can see the thanks for watching. I think it's every 45 minutes. Yeah. Thanks for watching. Yeah, I saw that uh, on Sunday. Yeah. yeah. That kept all, which is good. That is the only one that I want to have repeating. All right. So, how was work? Mm -hmm. Mm -hmm. It was... I guess you can't say it was... It was slow, but... It was okay. Yeah. It wasn't busy, and it wasn't that slow i think because like the weather people got off of work they want to go to the park because you know it was like what 80 okay 80 degrees or something so yeah, nice and sunny today. yeah it, it was warm so i think people were out enjoying the weather because i was told that yesterday was steady yesterday was really busy there was a lot of people you know going in so i was think i think that they were in buying stuff to hey let's go to the park tomorrow because the weather like tomorrow it's supposed to be like this again right yeah yeah so yeah they're you know they're out buying their stuff but other than that, I'm just waiting for them to, to finish setting all the, the the mods and everything for the displays so we can actually start doing a little bit more work. So once they get all that set up and going and, and get it all filled, then we'll have some uh, actual work to do. But I'm always finding things to do. I'm always going around organizing, cleaning up, moving things. Even if it was like to move two bags over, just to level it off or bring it to the front to make it easier for people to get to right instead of having like the four in the back and then two in the front i always try to bring them forward makes it easier i'm always finding stuff to do i just can't be all twiddling my thumbs walking around just like so but now that we got the seasonal section too we got to keep an eye on that so we got to go from my department over to the front and work over there too so here we go other than that work was all right
No, I, I see you got that uh, YouTube channel on there. That's good. Yeah. Did you work on the uh, on the on the info part yet? Have you fixed it or updated the the way it looks, the icons and stuff for the, down below where they, when they could click on the link? No, I'm not. Okay. Do I need to? Oh no, no. I was just asking if you you know if you ever done it because I'm trying to. Oh. Click on that. Oh no, no. I was just asking if you you know if you ever done it. Chief, you feedback to. How we get? Oh, you know why? Did you click on something? Because I just went to our oh, channel. Oh. Yeah, there's still some stuff I need to update on here, but for the most part, it's all done. Info. Oh, I see you added a couple of... Yeah, you did. You actually did change a few things. Oh, I've changed the graphics on it. Yeah, that's what some like. The graphics, when you click on it, 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 it takes you to the... Yeah. Yeah. That's good. Did you do the... Uh, we need to get to... Uh, what do you call it? The wish list for Amazon. Oh, I didn't even... I haven't even put one together yet. Yeah. We still, get to, we still need to get to that. Okay. Of all the equipment... Will you remember that? Yeah. I remember it. Give you something to do tomorrow. Actually, I have no tip in here. Amazon wish list, and then we gotta put that up. Uh, we'll order the phone adapter to go from this to the house phone. So we'll be able to use the house phone for studio phone. Okay. <coughs> Sounds good. Care. Sounds good. We're down to two viewers, so I should probably log off so we don't waste any more time. How long you been on? Thanks for watching. Uh, hour and 42 minutes. Oh. We'll be back yeah. tomorrow. Bye. Bye.